Read the opening page of the screenplay, The Sound of Music, if you haven't. Read the, read the first page, which describes the whole opening in its entirety. In fact, it was the first time I used the first person singular in a screenplay. I just said, here is what I want to see on the screen. Here's the effect I want. I want, you know. I went there for two weeks with my wife and just researched the place in its entirety. Because after all, this was a Broadway play taking place in a couple of sets. I got all my ideas as to where the scene should take place from having been there. In approaching doing a film musical, you have certain milestones. Because these are all pretty famous musicals, you know that you've got to get somehow to these numbers, these well-known numbers, unless they happen to be something that you're going to throw out of the movie. We did throw a few things out of The Sound of Music, but I did a lot of changing around of musical numbers, among many other things. And there again, it seemed how inappropriate for the mother abbess to be singing my favorite things. I felt, why in the world use my favorite things for the mother abbess to sing with Maria? How much more appropriate for Maria to try to pacify the children who are frightened by the thunderstorm and tell them what she does whenever she gets upset. She thinks about some of her favorite things, and before you know it, you're into the number. Much more appropriate. But it was such a great play. How do you say no to the opportunity to try to bring that to the screen?